Hey guys, we're back with another video, and this time we're playing some more Final Fantasy 7, and we're going to sell some Mastered All material so that we can get more Gil, and then we can purchase things like the Silk Greens for the Chocobos. So yeah, and you get the Silk Greens from the Chocobo Sage. So let's see how many Mastered All materials we have. Um, Okay, it's organized, and we have, uh, none? What? <laughs> okay, maybe on, maybe on our characters we have some. Uh, let me see, I thought I had at least one. Yeah, I have one, okay. <laughs> oh, two, there you go. See, I knew I had some. Oh, three. Nice. <laughs> okay, then let me put the other ones on. Yeah. Just put the other ones on the characters and then we'll sell those ones. Uh, yeah, they're all one star, so... Or level one, whatever you want to call it. Okay. Now we can sell those three. I think it just organizes it for us anyway. Let me see. Oh, uh, no, it doesn't. Okay. So, yeah, see, like, <laughs> all these other materials, like, if you sell it, it's just one gill for some reason. <laughs> but then when you sell a master all material, it's 1,400,000 gill. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna sell all three of those. Wait, then how much is not mastered all material? Oh, okay. <laughs> it's just zero, I guess. Okay. Well, now we have four million something gil. Nice. Okay. Oh, we're all level 62. Okay. Alright, so that should be enough for the chocobo stuff, hopefully. And now we go to the Chocobo Sage, up here, oh wait, over here, and let's get some Silcus Greens, how many, um, yeah, how many should I get, maybe like, um, should I just get 99? You know what? Yeah. Why not? <laughs> we have a lot of money anyway. Okay, so now that we got the silt <laughs> the silkus greens. Um now we have to get some chocobos. We have to get two chocobos, one male, one female, from the tracks at the gold saucer area. So let's go back over there. It's where the desert area is. And yeah. We have to find the one with the oh there's Ruby Weapon. <laughs> we have to find the one with the two fish enemies. Yeah, I think it's those ones there. I don't think there's any ones over here. Okay, so Oh wait, do I have Chocobo Lure on? Oh wait, what's this one? No. Okay, uh, where should I put it? Um, I could just put it here. Um, where is it? Wait, let me organize. How do I do that? Arrange material. Did that do it? <laughs> there you go. Does it matter if it's mastered? Uh, I don't know. Oh wait, actually. Oh, never mind. It might be a better chance of finding one if we have uh, mastered. <laughs> so yeah, we have to search for some chocobos. If it doesn't play the music, then yeah, it's not a chocobo. <laughs> And yeah, we have to do that a bunch of times for the other chocobos. 
Uh, there's like a way to do this whole gold chocobo thing without, um, without doing the chocobo racing and all that, but, uh, we're just gonna do it this way because why not? <laughs> Okay, yeah, this is not the one. So we're just gonna run. Yep, oh yeah, these two chocobos we're getting are the good chocobos. And then the next two after are the great chocobos. Let me look over here. Nope. Oh yeah, I was going to show Barrett's final limit break. Wait, how close are we to getting it? Okay, we're almost... Oh yeah, it's limit level 4. What is it again? Catastrophe. Okay. Yeah, we're, we're almost going to get it, so... Maybe I'll defeat some more enemies. Uh, if we get the wrong Chocobo, and then we'll... Or just random battles like this, and then we'll show it off. Okay. Oh wait, I have to let Barrett get hit. Because I don't think attacking raises the... Yeah. <laughs> wait, did that even do anything? Wait, let me see. It. Oh, it's doing a little bit. <laughs> Why don't I just, yeah, why don't I just wait for them to attack him? <laughs> okay, actually, maybe, like, the damage done determines how much it fills the bar. I don't know. <laughs> Okay, so are you gonna... Okay. Just attack Barret, please. <laughs> attack him, please. Yeah, see, like, when it does that attack, like, it doesn't fill the bar up that much. <laughs> Okay, I don't know, maybe we'll, maybe we'll find like stronger enemies and, and then try it. <laughs> maybe we'll go to the Sunken Gilnika and then do it there. But let's try to find these chocobos first. <laughs> Yeah, because these enemies out here are kind of weak. And these enemies have random cards that can kill you and stuff. <laughs> like with the... I think one of the cards casts death or something. Okay, let's just... Oh, I thought that was a pincer for a second there. <laughs> what does that one do? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, wait, actually... Oh, never mind. <laughs> I was thinking maybe if... You attack Barret with the other characters, <laughs> it'll fill the bar up. But no, I don't. I don't think that works. <laughs> that would be funny if that did work. Oh my gosh, I can't find the chocobo with the the two fish enemies. Okay, let me try like uh, this one. <laughs> Keep running in circles. We'll eventually find them. <laughs> I 
you're going to attack someone, you should attack Barret. Oh. Well, you healed him, okay. <laughs> I thought I'm like a really high level, like compared to these guys, I could just run away from battles like quickly, but okay. <laughs> Funny stuff. Okay, let's see. Nope. Am I looking at the wrong... Uh, am I looking at the wrong chocobo tracks or something? I thought this was the right ones. Yeah, because I don't see any other, like, close to the gold saucer. Yeah, those should be the right ones. <laughs> There's none like further down, so let's just keep looking on this one, I guess. <laughs> wait, no, never mind. I was thinking, oh wait. No, we need the two fish enemies. I forgot their names, but once you see it, then you'll know what it is. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah. Excuse me if you hear any noises, any weird noises, any stomach noises, any burp noises. <laughs> Excuse me if you hear any of that. <laughs> it's a tradition. <laughs> okay, we found this guy again, but no. We are not looking for you. We're just trying to get some good chocobos, and I don't think those ones are good chocobos. Yeah, the ones with the enemy that gives you aqua lung, I'm not sure, like, if it's a good chocobo or, like, something else, but, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, just keep running. Yep. Sid has his limit break now. <laughs> yeah, the great chocobos are gonna be in the Medeal area. And you have to find the one with the spiral enemy. <laughs> just run, just run. <laughs> Or should we test that out, like, see what that gives? If I keep finding that one. With, with the... I forgot what the name of that enemy is, but... <laughs> there you go, that's what we're looking for. Exactly what we're looking for. We better hurry up and... I don't know what this limit break's gonna... Oh wait, yeah, that might attack all enemies. <laughs> there you go, please. Nice. He did not run, so we got him. Or her, I don't know. So, Raha Nut. <laughs> okay, so now we get off. Oh, wait. No. Oh, my. What did I... 
I thought, wait, do I need to purchase stables or something? I thought when you get off, like, you can put them in the sta the stables, like, <laughs> what happened? Okay, let me see, let me see what's going on here. What did I do? <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. Oh, what is that? What has this world come to? Stars falling? What's next? With things the way they are now, how about raising a chocobo? No, I'm not trying to persuade you for money, it's just because of the way things are in the world. I thought that it would be a healthy thing for you to raise some chocobos. Hmm, you just happen to be in luck. It just so happens that we aren't taking care of any chocobos for anyone else, so... I could take care of six chocobos right now for 10,000 gil for chocobo. How about it? Yes. To raise a chocobo, you need, you'll need you need a chocobo stable. And they rent for 10,000 gil. Currently, I can rent out up to six chocobo stables. If you rent a chocobo stable, we will keep up to four of the chocobos you catch in the fenced area outside. At a later date, you can select a chocobo that you would like to put in your chocobo stable. Chocobo stables cost 10,000 gil. Yep. Rent it. Thank you. My grandson takes care of the chocobos. He's in the chocobo stable at the far right of the farm. Please tell him what you want. Wait, do I have to buy another one or how does this work? Yeah, let me buy another one. Oh, actually, I think you can only buy four, right? Let me see. Let me keep doing it. And let me try again. He's probably going to say no. Oh, never mind. Oh, maybe it's six. Okay, that's the sixth time. So let me, let me try it again. Yeah, okay. Okay, now I bought them all. We don't have enough room to rent out more than six here. Okay. Yeah, so you have to do that first. Because, <laughs> like, the chocobos you catch, they end up here in the fence area and then you go in here yeah you can hold six here because these two can hold chocobos as well okay now we can <laughs> now we can do the whole thing okay let's go back to the gold saucer area <laughs> I don't know how I messed that up, but... Okay, hopefully we find uh, the right chocobo. And stuff. <laughs> Just go back down here. Okay. Yep. Yeah, see, I don't think, like, when you master the chocobo lure material, I don't think it actually increases encounter rate. Unless it does, but, like, only by a little bit or something. <laughs> Maybe that's the case. Well, we're just gonna keep looking. Excuse me. <laughs> Choker bows, okay. Nope, that's not what we're looking for. Yeah, maybe like this battle, like it tricks you into thinking it's a really good chocobo. But then when you... Oh, he ran away before us. Okay. 
But then when you like put it in the stable, it'll probably say something like, like, oh, this chocobo is not very good or something. Cause yeah, when you get like the wrong chocobo, it'll say that. That's why we need the one with the two fish enemies. <laughs> okay, please. Nope. Yeah, they're like floating fish because like there's no water, but they're still floating. <laughs> Land fish or hovering fish. <laughs> from the battles till we find the chocobones yeah I'm just gonna keep looking on this this middle one here because I think it gives more luck or something I don't know <laughs> Searching. <laughs> okay, nope. Okay, another one, and yes, we got it. Okay, so we better kill these. Oops, don't use the limit break. There you go. Nice. <laughs> okay, now when we get off the chocobo. Now for the chocobo, yes. You can let it go or send it back to the staples. And now we need one more. Oh yeah, actually, you might need to like reset the game. Like if you accidentally get two males or two females. So that you can like re-roll the chocobo and then you get like one male, one female. Yeah, we might have to do that, but... <laughs> We'll see. As long as we get two, then once we get a female or a male on the first one, then we could just keep retrying for the second one. And then it will be it'll be all good. <laughs> Yeah, and then we're gonna do level 99 characters after the whole chocobo stuff, the chocobo things, and then we're gonna do uh, Omni Slash, like the whole Battle Square stuff. And then after that we're gonna do Ruby and Emerald Weapon. And then we might do uh, all the final limit breaks for each character, or well, except Eris because we didn't do that. <laughs> and um, <laughs> okay, yeah. See, they can kill your party members with the cards. Okay, I think he has the yeah. Yeah, and then, um, and then Sephiroth after that. Just 
Just keep running from the random battles. Yes, we need to find those fish enemies, but with the chocobo. <laughs> Keep running. <laughs> yeah, the, the low damage attacks don't really increase the limit bar that much. <laughs> Thanks for the heal, bye bye. <laughs> yeah, we'll just go to the sunken Gelnika after we get these good chocobos. Well, just one more good chocobo, and then yeah. Okay, we got something. Nope, we didn't get. What we wanted. <laughs> yeah, when you're running like on the chocobo tracks, you don't have to be exactly on the tracks either. Because I think it gives it to you if you're a little bit off. Yeah. <laughs> Just keep searching, we'll eventually find one more. <laughs> yep. Nope, we did not get another one. <laughs> Yeah, so for like Final Fantasy games, like I want to play 5 and I want to play 9 and 10. Because, yeah, I think those would be pretty fun to play. Because, yeah, some people say 10 is their favorite or 7 or 6 or 8. Etc. <laughs> Everyone has their own favorite, but yeah. Nope, we didn't get it. Okay, let's try again. Okay, we got another one. Nope. <laughs> That's not it either. Yeah, so for the Silkus Greens, we're gonna... Uh, yeah, we're gonna feed each of them at least 90 Silkus Greens. So yeah, actually we do need to keep going back to the Chocobo Sage to buy some more 
because you can only hold 99 at a time. So yeah, we're going to feed those greens to the four chocobos. Oh yeah, and for the other chocobos, like you can feed them 90 Silcus greens as well if you want. But I'm not sure if you really need to. But it's helpful for like the, the chocobo racing and the gold saucer. So I think I'm just going to do it for maybe all of the chocobos. So yeah. one more <laughs> please nope keep getting the fish enemies but like just regular battles <laughs> it's like it's teasing <laughs> uh no nope is almost filled <laughs> uh, if it takes too long maybe we'll look for the great chocobos and then come back here after that <laughs> or actually should we like do it one by one and then yeah actually maybe we should do it one by one so that we don't get confused yeah we might get confused on which ones are which oh yeah you can uh you can name the chocobos accordingly as well if you want because each time you put them in the stables you have to name them and they're usually like Chocobo A, Chocobo B. But yeah, you can rename them if you want. Well, actually, I don't know if you can rename them, but you can name them when you put them in the stables. <laughs> but yeah. Just one more, just one more. <laughs> Please, oh my. <laughs> Should I try one of the other ones?
Oh yeah, so like for the racing, uh, I think for each of them we can just race them up to class B, and then maybe the last two chocobos. I mean, oh, we found. Okay. <laughs> Let's do it, okay. Okay, I thought that didn't kill it for a second. <laughs> nice, okay. We have two chocobos. Send it to the stables, okay. Where is it gonna go? Oh, it disappears. <laughs> okay, so now we go back to the stables. Oh yeah, this cave, we might do that too. Maybe, I don't know. Yeah, we already did something there. We got some item there or something, but yeah. Wait, can you talk to them? I think you can, let me see. Oh, maybe you can't, okay. <laughs> I think you can only talk to them when you first get here and then you get the the Choco Mog materia or something. Okay, so let's move Chocobos. Yep, good, good. Okay, so first let's just put this one in. Put it in. Mail, okay. So Oh, never mind. It just comes default Choco for the name, so we'll just call this one uh, G. Oh, actually, wait, let me. Let's say G1. So that one is a male, and the other one is, wait, let's do this again, yes, male, okay, so we're gonna have to, oh wait, I did it already, so actually we might need to, <laughs> we might need to go back and find another one. Okay, so, I don't know, just, okay, we might need to go back and find another one, because I just did that. <laughs> okay, uh, Okay, why don't we, why don't we go to the sunken Gilnika first. <laughs> wait, let me see what this guy has to say. Oh wait, didn't we get like, the circlet or something from here? Large materia needs high level materia. Okay, let's go. <laughs> yeah, I kind of messed that up. Well, the thing is you're supposed to save between each step, but like, I don't know, I just did that. <laughs> Got messed up. Okay, so there's Emerald Weapon. Wait, where is the Gilnika? Oh, actually, it might be the other one. Yep, just under the ocean, or in the ocean, <laughs> cruising through in the submarine. Yeah, there it is. Okay, so let's just find some random enemies over here. I think enemies spawn in this room, right? 
Or no, did I not? Oh wait, let me heal just to be safe. Okay, maybe in this one we spawn and then they they appear. Okay, so we defeat some of them. Maybe just kill two of them and then leave the other two to attack Barret. Okay, so... Well, do they have another attack that does more damage? Okay, we'll just we'll just wait until they attack Barret. They keep attacking Cloud and Sid. <laughs> okay then. Attack Barry, please, please. Okay, why don't we find like a different, <laughs> a different enemy? Yeah, let me see how much experience these guys give. Cause grinding for experience down here is pretty good too, I think. Oh. Oh wait, does Barret have a ribbon? I don't think he does. He has a circle. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, I think the third ribbon is in the north crater, but we're not there yet, so... Well, we can go there now, but yeah. <laughs> oh wait, let me heal real quick. Yeah, I don't know if enemies spawn in the other room, but yeah. Okay, um... Yes, attack Barret, please. <laughs> They're attacking Cloud and Sid again. Okay, there you go. Maybe two or three more attacks. <laughs> just go for bear just do it just do it <laughs> there you go okay maybe one more maybe one more nope that wasn't enough <laughs> <laughs> Just one more. There you go. Oh, never mind. <laughs> we need another. No, we need more than one more. <laughs> okay, I don't know what's going on, but... Excuse me. Please, okay, there you go. Catastrophe. Just 
jumps in the air. Boom. <laughs> it's like a giant laser. Or just a giant giant shower of bullets or something. I don't know. <laughs> From his gun arm. Okay, so that's catastrophe. Wait, what does it say for catastrophe again? Oops. Check. Damages all opponents. Yep. It definitely did that. Oh yeah, I think we Oh, we don't have SIDS. Final limit break. Wait, do we need to give it to him now? Oh wait, I think we have one more third level limit break and then we can give it to him. Let me see, yeah. We're not there yet with Sid, but yeah. Yeah, and then Omni Slash, the only way you can get that before uh, the last battle of the game with Sephiroth is from the Gold Saucer from the Battle Square. So yeah. Yeah, make sure you don't run into ammo and weapon here. Hello. <laughs> oh, actually, we can just go up now and then, and then park the submarine. Oh, wait, I'm going too far. Oops. <laughs> okay, so yeah, I kind of messed up the chocobo thing. <laughs> kind of messed that up so we're gonna have to find another uh wait where are we we have to go back here we have to find another one. <laughs> oh wait did we heal because why not we have to find another one yeah <laughs> Actually, yeah, you don't have to do, like, the reset thing. Like, I don't know if people consider that cheating or not. <laughs> but, yeah. Like, for the reset thing for the, the Chocobo gender. Because you need one male and one female so that you can breed them. Yeah, you can do it either way, like, just finding them. And... Putting them in the stable, or just uh, resetting if you want. Doesn't really matter. <laughs> yeah, I thought like most of the time they're like male and female anyway, like when you put them in the stable. Cause like I thought it would be a higher chance for a female if you already have a male. I don't know. <laughs> I'm just gonna have to keep messing with this whole chocobo situation. Searching. <laughs> Keep getting regular battles. Yep, we have to do the same thing for the, the wonderful Chocobo as well. Oops. Keep 
keeps giving me regular battles. <laughs> I just want to see if we can find another one. Yeah, because we're pretty much done with, like, everything else. <laughs> okay, let's go back to the other tracks. There you are, but without the chocobo. We need you with the chocobo, my dude. <laughs> we need you with the chocobo. He's giving me regular battles. Okay, how about I put on the other chocobo alert materia and see if that works better for finding good chocobos? I don't know. Let's try it, because why not? Because maybe the higher level materia finds the, uh, the other one more likely. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, if you put two chocobo lure materials on, I don't think it really changes anything. I think it just sees the first material and it like disregards the other one or something. Excuse me. Yeah, I keep finding regular battles. Not sure why. <laughs> yeah, I just want to show this whole process because this is what you have to do for the choke about well the way I'm doing it because this is usually the way that I do it when I play through this game <laughs> stuff might take a while but yeah I don't know I think that was death, but yeah. Oh wait, I think it missed because I have the ribbon on. Yeah. Oh wait, maybe that was death or death sentence, but I think it was death. I keep finding regular battles. What's going on? <laughs> if I find one more regular battle, then I'm gonna put the other one back on. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm gonna put the other one back on. It's the fish again, but they need their partner, the chocobo, to be with them so they can be a good chocobo. Yes, that's what we need. <laughs> okay, now let's see if that does any good for finding the chocobos. I keep getting regular battles. I don't know why. Not sure what's going on here. <laughs> Can I find just one? Just one? <laughs> Click. 
crowd has to dance in circles for this. Let's try this one. Okay, we found something. Nope, that's not what we need. <laughs> Okay, uh, let's try here again, see if it, see if it gives us another one. Okay, oh yes, yes, nice. Okay, good. <laughs> they got one attack in, but yeah, good. Because <laughs> you don't want the chocobo to leave randomly. Okay, so let's... Let's go back here and see if it's a male or a female. Yeah, we should save the game. We should save the game before we check each one. Well, each second one, because after you get the first one, then, like, the second one just has to be the opposite. So, yeah, let's see what we can do here. Getting chocobos. It's a female. Nice, nice, nice. So we didn't really have to save, I guess, but yeah. Whatever. <laughs> okay, so we have male and female good chocobos. Nice. Good stuff. <laughs> Alright, so... We're in the grasslands area by the chocobo stables. Oh wait, let me just heal up because why not? And yeah. Oh, Cloud has like less HP than everyone else because he has a lot of material. All right, we're gonna save the game here. We got level 63, 62, and 62. Yeah, Barret has the most HP. Okay, so yeah. Hope you guys liked the video. Thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And yeah, in the next episode, we're going to get the two great chocobos, male and female. Okay, yeah. That's what we're going to do next time. <laughs> and yeah, I will see you guys later.